China just hit a major milestone in space with the launch of its final two Bidu-3 backup satellites. These aren't just any satellites, they're crucial to ensuring the reliability of China's global navigation system, which rivals GPS. But that's not all. These satellites also bridge the gap to the next generation Baidu-4 system, set to revolutionize navigation with cutting-edge technology for deep space, underwater, and indoor use. In this video, we'll break down what makes this launch so important, how it strengthens Baidu's position on the global stage, and what the future holds for this groundbreaking system. Stay with us as we dive into the technology driving China's space ambitions and why it matters to you. The final pair of Baidu-3 backup satellites, launched in September 2024, play an essential role in the overall reliability of the Baidu system. Let's start by understanding why backup satellites are so crucial. When it comes to Global Navigation Satellite Systems GNSS, consistency and reliability are paramount. Any downtime or malfunction in one of the primary satellites can result in significant issues for the users relying on it whether it's for military operations, civilian navigation, or critical infrastructure. These two satellites bring the total count of Baidu satellites to 60. But what sets them apart? These are not just ordinary satellites. They come with enhancements like autonomous integrity monitoring and advanced atomic clock technology. This ensures not only their reliability but also their accuracy, which is critical for navigation and timing services. Imagine you're using GPS for something crucial, like guiding an airplane or synchronizing a financial transaction. The margin of error has to be incredibly small, and these satellites help minimize that risk by providing precise and dependable data. Now, how does this benefit the end user? In short, these satellites help ensure that Baidu can continue to operate smoothly, even if one or more of its main satellites go offline. They provide a backup ready to step in when needed, which makes the system more resilient. This is a significant advantage for both China and its global partners who rely on Baidu for various applications. So, not only does this move help China maintain its independence from other navigation systems like GPS, but it also enhances the quality and reliability of its own services. But these satellites don't stop at being just backups. They're also equipped to conduct experiments that will help lay the groundwork for Baidu 4, China's next big step in navigation technology. By providing these dual roles, they serve as both a safety net for the present and a test bed for the future. This dual functionality makes them not just satellites, but a crucial part of China's space ambitions. The launch of these backup satellites is not just about reinforcing Beto 3 it's also about looking forward. With Baidu 3 now complete, China is already turning its attention to Baidu 4, which is expected to push the boundaries of navigation technology even further. So, what makes Baidu 4 so special? First, let's talk about the challenges that Baidu 4 aims to overcome. One of the key limitations of current navigation systems is signal interference. Whether it's dense urban environments or challenging terrains like mountains and oceans, weak signals can be a real problem. Bidu 4 is designed to tackle this head-on. It will feature stronger signals and better resistance to interference, making it more reliable even in the most difficult conditions. But the most exciting part? Bidu 4 isn't just focused on traditional navigation. It's setting its sights on more advanced areas like underwater, indoor, and even deep space navigation. Yes, you heard that right, deep space. The idea is to build a system that can provide accurate positioning not just on Earth, but beyond. This could be a game changer for future space exploration missions. Imagine astronauts on the Moon or Mars, navigating using Baidu 4. The satellites launched recently will play a key role in this transition. They will conduct experiments that will help solve the technical challenges required for Baidu 4, such as improving the system's signal strength and addressing issues like interference. Essentially, they are the foundation on which Baidu 4 will be built. By 2035, China aims to have a comprehensive navigation system that is more ubiquitous, integrated, and intelligent. This means that Baidu 4 will not only provide better global navigation, but also enable new applications we can't even fully imagine yet. 
children from precision agriculture to smart cities, the possibilities are endless. What we're seeing now is just the beginning of a much larger plan to revolutionize how we navigate the world and even space. China's Baidu system isn't just about offering an alternative to the U.S. Global Positioning System GPS. It's about creating a navigation network that positions China as a leader in space and technological innovation. Let's take a moment to understand the broader implications of this. First, having an independent global navigation system like Baidu is a major strategic advantage. It allows China to avoid relying on foreign systems like GPS, which could be restricted or disrupted in times of conflict. In other words, Baidu gives China full control over its navigation and timing data, a key asset for both military and civilian applications. But Baidu's influence goes beyond China. It's already being used by over half of the world's countries, particularly in regions like Africa, Southeast Asia, and the Middle East. This means that China is not only securing its own independence in navigation, but also offering an alternative to other nations, which can further extend its geopolitical influence. As more countries adopt Bidu, China's soft power grows. Another key aspect is the technological edge Baidu provides. The recent launch shows that China is capable of not only matching the capabilities of GPS, but, in some cases, surpassing them. According to reports, Bidu provides some of the most accurate positioning data available in certain regions. This accuracy is crucial for industries like transportation, agriculture, and telecommunications, making Bidu an attractive option for countries looking to modernize these sectors. Finally, let's not forget the role Bidu plays in China's broader space ambitions. With these backup satellites and the upcoming Bidu 4, China is positioning itself as a leader in space technology. This goes hand in hand with other projects like its Lunar Exploration Program and the development of its own space station. Bidu is a key piece of a much larger puzzle that solidifies China's role in the future of space exploration and technology. The launch of the final pair of Baidu 3 backup satellites is a monumental step for China's navigation ambitions. These satellites ensure the reliability of the current system while also paving the way for the future. With Baidu 4 on the horizon, we're not just looking at an upgrade in technology, we're witnessing the evolution of global navigation systems as we know them. The implications are vast from enhancing everyday applications like GPS navigation to supporting deep space missions in the future. China's commitment to building an independent, resilient, and advanced navigation system sets a new standard in the space race, challenging the dominance of systems like GPS. As we look ahead to the deployment of Baidu 4, one thing is clear China's role in the future of global navigation and space exploration is only just beginning. Thanks for watching, and if you're excited to learn more about the future of space technology, don't forget to subscribe and stay tuned for our next video.